pretty big dill plant. Um, and this is the mammoth dill. This is Tom here with Permaculture Wilmington. I was just out watering the yard, kitchen garden, and food forest. And um, I decided today is the day that we are going to harvest this wonderful dill. So this is the mammoth dill and um, it got huge. This is about, uh, I want to say six five, six feet, five inches. Um, I'm about almost six feet, inch or two short. So in terms of height, um, this is about, I want to say six and a half feet. So this was an absolutely wonderful plant. Um, we got a a lot of, of dill usage off this in terms of um, putting the leaves in sauces for flavors and uh, we've already harvested a few seeds here and there um, to use in a couple dishes but uh, today we're going to harvest it so um, and this is so we can use the seeds long term so what we're going to do is basically just pull the leaves off and put them in a paper bag and this allows them to continue to dry out um, if there is any moisture on this from say like dew this morning that's fallen or maybe some mist that came off the garden hose while I was watering around it um, We want to just make sure we keep it in uh, arid condition for at least a couple days after we put it um, Put them all together in a, in a confined space So uh, this is what you do guys. Um, so I'm gonna just be pulling these off This can take a little while do it this way. I could just cut these little tassels off, um, but then we would have the seeds that have little stems coming out of them instead of just the seeds themselves like we buy in the store. Um, I suppose it probably wouldn't matter too much, but if we did use the seeds in a dish, uh, we wouldn't want it to be twiggy and stimmy. And it makes for smaller storage space as well. I'm just rubbing it together with my fingers over the bag just to get the seeds off the tassels like so wow look at this big one this one's huge there may need to be a little bit of winnowing where we take a little bit of the tassels out, stimmy stuff, but um, all together this looks pretty good. This is enough seeds to last a year at least, probably more. A lot of dill seeds. This is Tom with Permaculture Wilmington. Hope you're having a great day.